gotta say, I like what they did with the place. It's looking pretty good. Cool. Oh my gosh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Dumban. Dumban's photobombing everything, and I got a good look at his crotch. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, everybody, Skyrim here. Welcome back to another episode of Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition. In the last episode, we saw the conclusion of some side quests that have been running since the very beginning of our journey. We, uh,. Also found that giant's treasure and did a little bit of exploring around Bionis Leg and killed a pretty scary sp spooky spider at the shrine. And uh, we got our way here to uh, where we have to go to get up to the higher levels of the Bionis, uh, the higher levels of the Bionis. But before we could do that, this little Nopon merchant over here told us that we need to complete a ceremony for that to happen. So we need to find four emblems around Satoru Marsh. And we already have two of them, just by doing some basic exploration. And this time, we're going to be going around and finding the other two and hopefully uh, opening the way forward for us. But first things first, I think it's time for a party change. Uh, I want Shulk in the lead. No particular reason, I just kind of, I always just like playing as Shulk because, you know, Shulk's my boy. And... I do like Dumban. I think I'll have Sharla in the middle. Just in case we need to do any, uh... A chain attack so that way it doesn't end on her and we can possibly uh combo get a chain going because it's not like she has she like downright at lacks like chain potential it's just because she comes at the end she can downright just ex destroy uh whatever you might have built up so it might be uh, that might be another tip for you guys uh if you're gonna have charlotte in your party uh have her at least like in the middle i'll have dumbman uh, I'll have Dumban here, so that way we can, uh, because, you know, he's still fresh and new, and also you gotta build affinity with all these characters. Uh, let's see, nothing, nothing really crazy over here, I was just curious. Alright, so, in order to find ourselves our little, uh, little pieces of the, of the pie, we gotta go start our journey down here through the basin cave. And it looks like our last two uh, pieces are going to be right down this pathway. So, we'll have to keep a keen eye out. Now, you got... Well, I recommend you do, guys. You got to travel very slowly and go... Don't don't go with the current, but... You know, just keep an eye on where it drops off. Like over here. You don't want to go down the current forever and ever and ever. Let's see, we got storm vangs. Pretty scary stuff. I'm gonna want to walk because we're only four levels higher. So we're gonna do that. Just slowly inch forward, go around here. Uh, got the Happy Carnival, which is a fantastic name for an item. You know, really gets you going. Be like, wow, it's a Happy Carnival. And we look over here. We got the White Radiant. It's the Path of Radiance, guys. Holy crap. Yeah, I just blew your mind. And now... Hop down here. Take 616 damage. You know, that's part of the plan. It's always part of the plan. And... We can get dropped off right here. And hey! Would you look at that! Lacus Flammy! Just what we needed for the quest. Here I was being paranoid, like, oh man, maybe I'm missing it somewhere. Nah. I think I kind of realized at some point, uh, I realized at some point, I'm like, oh, it's probably, we're probably going to find that uh, as we go along here. So we'll probably see the conclusion of that quest. Because we already made so much progress in the main story, or the main, uh, the main quest objective, I should say. Um, just for the sake of consistency, we'll probably handle... Anything revolving that quest, like if we get what we need, um, at the end, uh, we do got Amber Fisher here who could potentially drop what we need. In fact, actually, he probably has a guaranteed chance of dropping what we need. I owe you. And anyway, we're level thirty-one. This thing's level twenty-seven. It shouldn't be a problem at all. Uh, I'm binded. No, I don't like being binded. It makes me sad.
All right, let's let's go for a trade attack right now. Let's see, go for a stream edge. Go for a metal blast. Go for electric gut buster. Ah, uh, I was trying to be cool here. Fifteen thousand damage, that ain't bad. Actually, Charles is actually kind of good for this because uh, she can, she does do well against flying enemies. Help me, help me with the days, please. Good job, Sharla. You're doing great. Good one, dumb man. You did it. Twin flammy eggs, iron boots, pandemonium, and empress greaves. All right, that's one out of two. Still, still miss some. Well, hopefully this one, this guy over here, will provide me the new tree ants. I don't like how close he is. I am kind of concerned, but it shouldn't be a problem if we make this quick. Should be an issue. I was paranoid over nothing. Uh, oh, whoa. Hey, buddy. Didn't see you there. Uh, looks like I'll have to like swim down the path again, but at least we know where they are. Uh, let me check uh, Dumbman's weapon. Whoops, wrong thing. The Pandemonium. Back attack plus two. Yeah, if this were the Shulk show, you know, I, I'm pretty sure this would be pretty good. But, um, you know, I ain't, I, I ain't, I ain't feeling it. I ain't, I ain't feeling it, you know? You know, you know guys, I, I just, it's just, just not, not my day. Just, just I'm, I'm not feeling it, guys. Ooh, Shulk learned a new art. Good job, Shulk, me boy. I'm Mr. Krabs now. Uh, Shulk, you learned Battle Soul. Sacrifice half of HP to fill the talent gauge. And I hate to say it, guys. I mean, he's got Monado art, so technically Shulk has more arts than any other character in the game. This is the last art Shulk learns. With the exception of Monado arts, because, I mean, obviously with all these slots, you know there's going to be more. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge. But in terms of regular arts, this is all Shulk gets. And, you know, it's a pretty solid selection. Battle still ain't bad. Uh, with this, uh... Uh... Actually, I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna hold off. Just a moment. Haha, <laughs> the Brogs can't... Can't fight me anymore. <laughs> what a bunch of losers. Anyway. Got that last Radiant. Final offering that we needed. Wow, guys, can you believe it? Can you believe it, guys? Four offerings, just a week away. Woohoo! Alright, well, I'll definitely look back around to do that quest, but before we go back and check things out, uh, I do want to go over here because there is the Eta Deposit, and you know me, I love my Eta Deposit. I thought that was a red item ward for a second, but nah, it was just, uh, it was just a crystal. Yeah. Yeah, I got medium rare. I want it raw. And if I look at my map... Oh, wow, I was right there the whole time, guys. Wow. Man, I really suck. Uh, you know what? Because the map's going to bother me. I'm going to... I'm just going to waddle, waddle down. Waddle down the stairs. And just, just taking the sights, you know. And he waddled away. Waddle, waddle. And he waddled away, waddle waddle. And he waddled away, waddle waddle. To the very next day. Bum 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 bum. Guys, you gotta have fun. It's all part of the world. Part of the world? It's all part of the fun. Alright. Uh, let's actually level up arts. I was gonna give it a minute, but I don't think we're gonna have an opportunity. Uh, let's see here. Shulky poo, shulky poo. Uh, let's. Well, shield's already maxed out. I'm gonna get Buster and Chant up, just to have that there. And you know, you just got Battle Soul. Uh, let's let's give that a couple levels. Uh, let's level up Stream Edge, and that's all Shulk can do. Sharla. Uh, let's see. Uh, you did just get Head Shaker, so we'll level that up. So at least you can do a little bit of damage. Uh, level up Metal Blast to the max. 
Get Thunderbullet up to the max. Tranquilizer, sure. Why not? Uh, Dunban. Uh, let's see. Yeah, sure. Gale Slat. Let's level up everything one more time. Oh, I don't have enough. Uh, let's get Peerless up. And Battle Eye. And Spirit. Yeah. Yeah, sure, Blind Boss, and why the hell not? Uh, Ryan, we can level up Dice of Bat. Good stuff, good stuff. Well, you know, you like to see it. And yeah, we'll get Engage up. Emblem Engage. And that's it. Alright. Now we got that. Uh, let's head on over, over here. A work of art. Uh, I believe that's for leveling up your arts. What do you freaking do? I'm a freaking smart man. Alright, so let's go ahead and offer, give ourselves the offering to the adulthood emblem. And we got a boss! The Toral Guardian! Which is the last thing to stand between us and heading up to the upper Bionis Leg. Uh, I keep on saying Bionis Leg. We've been on the Bionis Leg for so long. Uh, the upper Bionis. This thing is not too crazy. As you can see, we're kind of uh, wrecking it. It's not particularly difficult, so you don't really have to worry about it too much. It's not going to be something that'll... As long as you've been doing quests and are at least a decent level, you shouldn't have any trouble. Uh, let's look at Battle Soul. So take half of our HP to fill the party gauge a little bit, and we can uh, get light heal going and uh, refill all the damage that we built up or that we took. See, guys, it's cold. We're doing good. We're straining this guy, guys. It, it ain't even funny. It ain't even funny. Uh, you know what, Charlotte? I am ready for a chain attack. Uh, let's go for a stream edge. Let's go for a thunder bullet. And let's go for a gale slash. Probably not the best chain attack. Ooh, go for another one. Uh, let's go for a backslash. Ooh, another one? Okay. Uh, let's go for metal blast. Nice. That was pretty good. Let's go for Mob Buster. Uh, worst thing this thing could do is, like, stab you with poison. And, I mean, yeah, it kind of sucks, but it's nothing you really need to worry about. I say that and I almost died. I clacked my teeth really hard. And now the stairs open up for us, and now we can proceed forward. But we're not going to do that yet, because we got to go get ourselves some eggs. Which means we're going to go swim back down the hole and have ourselves a good time. I mean, I don't have to. Actually, would it be faster to teleport? I think it would be faster. Theoretically, it would be faster. Oh! Okay. Okay, buddy. I completely forgot about you, but you know what? You're just chilling here. Fine. Wasn't gonna do much other than this episode anyway. Didn't have much planned. I was gonna save some other big topics like, uh, you know, the reconstruction of Colony 6 for later, so I wasn't gonna be doing that. Not today, this at least. So, there's that. So I just need to kill these guys. There is no escape. You are not escaping my wrath. Because my name is Dumban. Do that. Up, oh, Dumban got knocked down. That ain't good. Whoa, whoa. You want to dance with him? Whoa. Getting a little freaky. 
Getting a little freaky, dumb man. Uh, let's go for a chain attack. Do that. That'll blast. Dang it. Darn diddles. The timing was not everything, guys. Uh, did not mean to heal Sharla, but, you know. Shoot. Actually, this could be potentially bad. We need to build up the gauge. Well, we could potentially make this work. Okay. Thanks to Sharla, we could actually probably... We could probably do this. Let's see. Heavy Crash 2. Why did I have to do Buster, bro? <gasps> he did the scream, guys. Alright. Gotta build this up fast. Will I do it in time? Uh, Maybe. Okay, shield. Good. Got it! Perfect. Oh my god. That was the clutch, guys. That was what we call a clutch. Uh, Shadow Eye, please. Sharla, work your magic and take the aggro. Good. Hard crash. Good daze her. Okay. Get a backslash. We have enough to revive Dumban. Let's heal him. See Gale on Sharla. Ah, uh, that's nothing we can actually stop. Unless we kill him. Perfect, dumb man. You did it. I'm so proud of you. King Cluster, Iron Rifle. <gasps> that's all three Rogal Axe Crests. Now they should be able to fix the bridge. They can investigate the ruins as well. Exciting stuff, all this. Some Rhine. Alright, well, Dumb Man learned a new art. Tempest Kick. <gasps> Tempest Kick! Oh my god! Air waves deal damage. Removes enemy buffs after Gale Slash. We're getting rid of Blinding Bossom. Bossom? <laughs> well. Uh, Tempest Kick. It's a pretty, pretty swell move, gotta say. I wasn't planning on fighting that unique monster, but I'm glad I did. You know, it's nice. It's nice to be appreciated for once. Anyway, we got some flammies to kill. The flammies. Let's see, you got the Torta over there, he's chilling. Don't want no trouble, Torta. We don't want no trouble. I just want to kill this guy. Guy who's just chilling, minding his own business. I don't got time for small fry. There we go. Do we get it? Nope. Well, that's fine. That's fine. We can kill Amber Fisher. Uh, I want you to get away. Move away from the nebula. I don't want to fight him, you know? Ah, oh, it is. Did not mean to do Battle Soul. I meant to do Shaker Edge. So we can call that a fail. We'll get a safe Shadow Eye. There we go. Uh, critical condition. And that's for getting uh, afflicted with statuses like days and all that stuff. Multiple times. So that's another quiz for the. Another quiz? That's another achievement for the books. Let's go for a Buster. And we'll go for a Chain Attack. Why not? What bam? What bam? Oh, let's go for a tempest kick. Good job, dumb man. Or not dumb man. Charlie got a level up. 
good one, Charla. There we go. Cracked on, or clacked on. Clack claw, I can't, can't speak. A journey diadem, and we got the eggs. So now we can go back and talk to that guy who was starving to death. You know, the guy from like two videos ago. He's waited long enough. He's hungry. He's starving. He's like, help. Please. Please. I'm hungry. Bro is... I was to say bro is thirsty. Oh yeah, we got the guns. I'll take a look at them. I don't think I'll use them. Oh, well, the king cluster is not that bad. I'll give it that. But you just cannot top Gatto, Gatto's rifle. You just can't top it. It's like impossible to top. I need to stop saying top. That's bad. It's no no. Got the Miss Rogel. I don't want to fight, buddy. I don't want to fight you. I just want to walk by and not even think about you. Got a happy carnival? You know what? That's great. Oh, you want to fight? Okay. Okay, guess we're fighting. I guess we're fighting. You're going to die in two seconds anyway, dude. I just try to save you from an agonizing death, you know. I just try to be the friend. I just try to be the hero. I've gone turbo. Wait, can I, can I back Sastra from here? Uh, I can. The key is to make it. I'm DJ Khaled or Khalid. Okay, let's get going. Oh, uh, you know what? I'm a change party. I may want to show up for the boss fight. Let's have Ryan. That party. We haven't had much Ryan time since the beginning. I mean, we played for him with the played with him with, for a little bit, at the, like before the Ether Mine, but that was about it. We haven't had Ryan time in a while. Let's freaking feed this son of a gun. You brought for me? They look really yummy. Zazadon feel much better now. You such nice people. Well, that's that. You saved Zazadon's life. Zazadon no no have to die now. Thank you so much. Zazadon give you this as thanks. Miss Gel, Miss Cream, Miss Sandals, which means the characters are gonna get even more naked now. Which means we can have Charlotte fully in the nude, right? No, I'm kidding. All right, Zazadon's got another quest for us. Can you help Zazadon again? Watch just that attack Zazadon so scary. Zazadon can no go, no can go out. That is a bit of a pain. It is a problem. If Zazadon go to go out to find food, monsters attack him again. Zazadon no wants to go out until it's safe. You can help Zazadon. You saved Zazadon's life. It's your job to keep Zazadon safe. Why are you all the Nopon we meet so weird? Would you ra would you rather have we hadn't saved you? Sazadon only choking. Sazadon are really grateful. There's still t lots Sazadon has to do. Yeah, I knew you were joking. What do you want us to do? Sazadon no can go out. Still too, too it's still too dangerous. Monsters that attack Sazadon are near glowing obelisk. They ogre bun bunyas. Sazadon wants you to kill them. Eight ogre bunyas in Storm Marsh. You're so come to help Sazadon. Sazadon's still not feeling too well from last time. Good luck. No sweat, we'll be done before you know it. Yeah, I'll help too. Thanks, Sharla. You're so kind. You're so good. Still... Still no progress with Sharla and Ryan. Thank good. Uh, let's hop down. Uh, these ogre bunnias are just chilling out here. So let's get them. Bone Uppa! Go for a shield bash. Oh! But we must! <laughs> Varl cut him off. She said we could trade four pieces of bunny scent wood for it. We only need a few more. Is that what she said? Goddamn visions. He doesn't have time. Oh, that was Dice of Bat right there, guys. Thought you'd know. Ground to a pulp. We make a great team. I don't know what that one is off the top of my head. But, you know, we grounded them to a pulp. You know, that's all that matters. Okay. Let's sort this out nice and 
Let's kill the Olgas. Fine, you want to be close to each other? Go for a War Slash. Back to bat. Okay. Sword Drive. Boom. We do, Charlotte. We do. I agree. We do make a great team. Ogres have layers. Now tear them up. Could you tear them up, guys? That's two bunny ascent woods that we needed. We're just knocking them all out. I thought. All right, let's do that. Let's go for a war swing. Hit everybody you love. I not mean to go wild down, but you know, it's all right. Man, Ryan is just the combo guy. You know, we just chain these kills right after another. All right, last couple guys should be right here. I say that when I clearly see that they were right there in front of me. Shield Bash! Let's do that. Set a sword drive and blow that man up to smithereens. Shala! Do that. And that takes care of them. Get that scent wood that we needed. I got they didn't specify who needed the scent wood. It's just that like, oh man, we could trade it with her. It'll be so great, so cool, so awesome. It was so great. It would be so awesome. It would be so cool. It would be the most incredible superhero movie with special effects. I think I've well and truly lost it, guys. Only 22 videos since the Xenoblade and I've well and truly lost it. I've lost my marbles. I've lost it. And once we finish with Zaz Zazadon stuff, we should be good to go. You killed them for Zazadon? Zazadon really, really happy. Well, that's that. Yeah, great job, everyone. But Zazadon feel like he forgot something important. Never mind. Just to say thank you. Please take. The swept gear and agility up to gem. Don't mind if I do. Oh, Zazadon's got another quest, because of course it ain't that easy. Oh, you! You can help Zazadon! There are another monster that wants to eat Zazadon! A flying monster! That's a bit of a pain. There should be no problem for you with your defense force trading. This is even worse than the 1,000 press-ups Vanguard makes us do. Zazadon really not want all this trouble. Flying monsters are even better than bunny as you killed. He'll come to eat- he'll come eat Zazadon! Zazadon's still not feeling well. Zazadon has been big danger! you all out killing bunny ass. Must have seen big flying monster. You should have thought we kill flying monster for friend Zazadon. That's some interesting logic. I doubt that a Homs would, a ha would arrive at the same conclusion. Zazadon no care about that. Big monster wants to kill Zazadon. Looks as if we have no choice. Will you tell us the name of this monster that is out to get you? Sunlight Shvak on Baron Moor. Zazadon will want you to kill it. It should be easy for you. The Sunlight Shivak in the area of Baron Moor and Satoru Marsh, only at daytime. Sazada knew you would help. Sazada, I'm so happy, thank you. No sweat, we'll be done before you know it. Ryan, I admire your spirit, but we have to be careful. Oh yeah, I totally agree. I'll leave that stuff to you. Dang, Ryan. Let me show your stuff. Uh, let's see, Baron Moor. Where could you be? Mr. Beast. What does he teach? Blasphemy and greed. Uh, where is the Baron Moor? I... Oh, right there. We might have actually already killed this thing. Is it? Oh my god, we already killed it. Well, can't go for seconds. Maybe we can kill it faster, now that we're more stronger. I'm not mean to go for Shield Bash. 
Ah, oh, he knocked me down. What the hell? How does it feel killing the same unique monster two uh, quests in a row? Go for Dice of Bat. Go for Thunder Bullet. Uh, let's see. Uh, Tempest Kick. Lamest chain attack ever. I'm like the comic book guy. Boom, uh... The Simps... Simmons. Let's go for the Sword Drive. Yeah. Kick him in the face. Yeah, Ryan, you do it. I just gotta do these quests at the same time, you know. Do that. Oh, there he goes. Uh, let's get try to get the aggro on Ryan, because Ryan's supposed to be the aggro guy, you know? Hard crash. I don't know if we'll be able to stop that. I mean, if it, if it hits Ryan, I mean, I guess that's okay. Aha, it's gonna do less. Dumban, you really are a hero. Help me. Thank you, Dumban. You're a real hero. Just like Charlotte said. I'm just repeating these points. Heavy Crash 2? That's not gonna fly. I'd rather you do it on uh, old Ryan. Yeah, let's see if we can do it. Go for hammer beat. There we go. Uh, let's go for Gale Slash. Go for another one. Uh, sword Drive. I probably should have gone for Gale Slash, actually. I didn't use Gale. I said Gale Slash, and I didn't use Gale Slash. What the hell am I talking about? What change in the future? Let's just kill this thing. There we go. Takes care of that. Get ourselves some Empress Arms. And now let's head back over here. And go talk to our good pal Zazadan. And I think that might be everything. I don't want to go too far ahead because for all I know he could come up with another quest and be like, Oh my god, oh my god, it's horrible. Zazadan was promised free Fortnite V-Books and was not given the free V-Books. I don't know. Like I said before, guys, I have well and truly lost it. You're watching the world's most insane Xenoblade player. Which, I mean, if you know the fandom, that might not be too far-fetched to believe. But, you know, when you play long RPGs, you know, you gotta ramble. You gotta ramble sometimes. Alright, Sazadon. Let's help you out here. Sazadon knew you could do it. There's nobody better than you to protect Sazadon in the whole wide world in the whole world. I'm tired of saying Sazadon, but Sazadon still no feel well. Why does Sazadon still feel bad even though he rests so much? Really strange. But now there's no more danger thanks to you. Sazadon's so grateful. Well that's that. That's right, good job, Ryan. Cheers, Dumban, nice of you to say so. Now Sazadon can rest in safety. You're the best. The swept gauntlets and HP up to gem. Nice. He's still not done. Dang. Sazadon's still worried about something. Sazadon still feel bad. Why is Sazadon no get better? That's a bit of a pain. There should be no problem for you with your defense force training. I'm not sure what defense force training has to do with everything. It's even worse than it. Don't yeah, we get the press ups. Maybe Sazadon ill. Sazadon wants you to bring medicine. If no have if no have medicine, Sazadon. Sazadon drink Napa potion, make illness and injury get better. It should be outside a black back exit of cave near Napon Merchant Camp. Sorry, but Sazadon wants you to find him and bring it for him. So we need to find the Napon Potion near the Lacus Swamp. So to ask for so many things, but Napon Potion definitely makes Sazadon feel better. No salt will be done before you know it. Yes, I too will give it my all. I agree, Dumban. You will give it your all. Alright. 
So this potion is just chilling, chilling right here. In this little alcove that we have been down before. I'm assuming the potion doesn't stop, stop, no, the potion doesn't spawn until you activate that quest. Probably doing things in a very unconventional way, but you know what? It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's okay. Just calm down. Just calm down. Not quite, buddy, but Haha, -ha, I can walk by you guys and you can't do a darn thing about it because I'm from the sale. Which is technically true. Alright. Kick, punch, it's all in the mind. If you get that reference, I'll give you... I'll give you a hug. I'll give you guys a hug. Virtual hugs for all who get the reference. Oh man, my my legs, or not my leg, my foot's falling asleep. I think I could feel it. I'm just trying to enjoy myself. You know, I was worried. I was a little bit worried. I was worried that this could be a short episode, but actually, no, it's quite a chunky one. And there was story progress in like the first half of it, so you know, that was a, that was a wild, and that was a wild one, wildy coyote. All right, let's go talk to Zazadan, buddy, old pal. What you got for us? I got your potion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stop a potion. You found it. This makes Zazadan feel better. Now Zazadan have no more bad feeling. Oh, that's that. You're looking very pleased with yourself. I guess you do deserve some of the credit. What, really? Cheers, Shala. Sassadon's so happy to take this as a thank you. It's very good. Sweat boots and ether up too. Ooh, that actually is kind of good. He's got more. Dude, bro's got f a million quests for us. Oh, it's you again. Thank you so much for always helping Sassadon so much. Now Sassadon feel good like before. Do you know about a thing called a red pollen orb? I'm all ears. You know, no. You can use Red Pollen Orb to make amazing thing. Here's Zazadon, give you one. Try dipping it in Shining Pond. Maybe something good happen. You certainly do seem excited. I'd be lying if I said I was not intrigued. Great! Once you see what it make, you want more and more. Is it really that amazing? I must admit that I have never heard of it before. Zazadon only telling you because he trusts you so much. So you should trust Zazadon. You'll see an amazing thing I want you to make. The Dark Swamp Shining Ponds Tor Marsh. Zazadon, you accept? Let's make you Zazadon's friends. No sweat, we'll be done before you know it. Yes, I too will fairly change. Be careful, don't lose Red Pollen Orb. So Zazadon, Zazadon gives us the Red Pollen Orb. Ooh. Looks like we got some links. Look at this. Look at this, guys. Oh, you know what? That means the affinity between Ryan and Dumban. If we check this. Yep, they're happy. Why hasn't Ryan and Sharla been freaking getting all buddy-buddy? And they did so much together. I mean, I guess maybe it was Shulk doing all the talking. I don't know. I'm confused. Anyway, the Shag Pod, we already know where it is. We found it by ourselves. So we can dip this pollen orb in here. I'll dip the red pollen orb into the water. I'm gonna take a sip of my drink. Because talking as Zazadon hurts. Something that looked like food has appeared. Let's go back and see Zazadon. Hi, more caviar. So now with this, we gotta go all the way back. We've just been going back and forward, back and forward. And I'm sick of it. And I'm not gonna do it anymore. Man. I'm having a fun time. Why does it seem like I'm always talking about things on this slope? I don't get it. It's always this slope. And it confuses me. It confuzzles me. I gotta say, I, I like the detail of that weapon. Looks pretty good, I gotta say. Alright, Zazadon. Hopefully I don't have to talk as you anymore. I'm tired of you. How was it? It's interesting, right? Huh? Not really. Too bad it looked like you don't understand how good it is. If you don't understand, give Zazadon high more caviar. If Zazadon tried to make it, monsters attack him. Zazadon, glad you make it. 
Well, that's that. That's right. Good job, Ryan. Cheers, Dunban. Nice of you to say so. This is so good. You know, understand. Zazanar, no can help it if you know, understand. Got the pioneer for Dunban, even though we already have that. Oh my god, dude. Stop. No more. No more quests. Sazadon, sad. Sazadon, have problems. Sazadon, don't know what to do. What is it? You're looking down on the dumps. You come just in time. Sazadon needs to send half more caviar, but deliver, deliver not upon no come. Sazadon, so worried. Sazadon, don't know what to do. Then you come and talk to Sazadon. Means you want to help, right? Should be too much work if all we have to do is take it. Or that stuff attract monsters. That no happen. It's just a coincidence last time. It's just because monsters think Sazadon look delicious. That's simple. We just have to deliver it. Just take high-board caviar to the Nopon called Dadaba. Dadaba live far, far away from Satoa Marsh. Says that I think you might meet Dadaba. Easy job for you, right? It says that I'd be happy to do so. A male Nopon called Dadaba. Sazadon so happy for you to help. Now Dadaba Dada, Dada, be no angry at Sazadon. The sweat will be done before you know it. You sound very confident, Ryan, but stay focused. I know, I know. Make sure Dadaba get it safe. Thank you. Alright, well, it looks like, uh... That one we won't have to do quite yet, unless... Hold on, let me check my affinity chart. Because you never know. So, Tata... I just gotta look at these Nopon, you know? You never know where they are. Uh, let's see. Karugu, Batu Batu, and Daza. Okay. So we have not encountered this Dedaba yet. So we'll have to see this guy uh, later. But hey, at least we got that done. Oh, thank God. I was worried. He had... So How many quests did this man offer? How many quests? I gotta see. Whoops. Zazadon in danger. Zazadon still in danger. It's all the mine. I'm serious delicacy. Five of them. Jesus. Actually, no, six of them. This is a sixth quest, bro. All right. All right, all right, all right. We completed the ceremony to allow us to go higher up into the Bionis, and we could do that. Or, well, hold on. Let me rephrase that. We did the ceremony for, and killed the Satoru Guardian, and with that uh, look at Ryan's ass, uh, we have the way forward to the higher up, uh, higher portions of the Bionis. That we can explore now. And according to Dixon, which he said last episode, he said that that leads to Magna Forest, which is our next destination on our journey up the Bionis. And then we also helped up Zaz Zazadon a whole lot, which, you know, that was the whole rest of the episode. And with that being said, I think we're going to call it quits. Next time on Xenoblade Chronicles Definitive Edition. Did you really think we're going to go up the Bionis? that quickly? Nah. What we're gonna do instead is we're going to go and see what we can do about the recon reconstruction of Colony 6. Because trust me, you're gonna want to learn about that. See you guys then.